Sample preparation. Obtain sample per AASHTO T168, reduce sample per AASHTO R47. When running multiple tests on a large sample, the results must be within 0.014 of each other, then averaged. Place hot mix asphalt on a clean surface. Spread the hot mix asphalt sample for faster cooling. Separate the fine aggregate particles until they are no larger than a quarter inch. Let the hot mix asphalt cool to room temperature. Record the weight of the bowl. Place the cooled hot mix asphalt into the bowl. Now record the weight of the bowl and sample. To calculate the mass of the dry sample, subtract the bowl weight from the bowl and sample weight. This is the A in the equation. Next, add water at 77 degrees Fahrenheit to cover the sample about 1 inch. Place the bowl and sample in the mechanical agitating device and use water to wet the o-ring of the vacuum lid. Vacuum the hot mix asphalt to remove air at a pressure of 27.5 plus or minus 2.5 millimeters of mercury for 15 plus or minus 2 minutes. The hot mix asphalt will be agitated continuously for 15 minutes with a mechanical device. If a mechanical device is not available, the release of entrapped air can be done manually every 2 minutes. This is the method used to manually facilitate the removal of entrapped air at 2 minute intervals. The following steps to obtain the submerged weight of the hot mix asphalt needs to be completed within 10 plus or minus 1 minutes. Fill the water bath to overflow level with 77 plus or minus 2 degree water. Water should be coming out of the overflow spout. Attach the immersion apparatus to the bottom of the scale. zero or tear the scale. Immerse and suspend the bowl and hot mix asphalt for 10 plus or minus one minutes. After the 10 minutes, record the weight of the submerged bowl and HMA. Then remove the bowl and HMA from the water and empty the HMA out of the bowl. Next, resubmerge the empty bowl for another 10 minutes to determine the weight of just the bowl underwater. To calculate the weight of the submerged hot mix asphalt, subtract the submerged weight of the bowl from the submerged bowl and hot mix asphalt weight. This is C in the equation. Here's the theoretical maximum specific gravity formula, the GMM. Report the GMM to three decimal places. To calculate the theoretical maximum density, multiply the GMM by the density of water at 77 degrees, which is 62.245 pounds per cubic feet. Report the theoretical maximum density to the nearest 0.1 pound per cubic foot. 